Hello everyone, and welcome back once again to another day in Minecraft. I thought today that we should go and check on someone that we haven't checked on in quite a while. I thought we should go and pay a visit to Simon and Waggers. But while I came down here, I noticed that they have an unexpected visitor. Oh, two unexpected visitors. Where are we? Uh, looks like it's going to be an action packed uh, start to the episode. You got these degenerates over here. And also, in Simon and Waggus' pen. Uh, I don't know where he went. Uh, has he gone over that way? We have a skeletal horse. Just relaxing with the boys. So, I'm pretty sure that if I attack him, he's going to spawn a bunch of skeletons. Lightning Striker and whatnot, and I don't want to risk Simon and Waggus getting hurt. So we're going to leave him to his own devices, I think, and we'll just deal with these vagabonds instead. So we'll just uh, aggro them a little bit. They're going to get pissed. That's okay. Oh, good dodge. Good dodge. Good dodge indeed. Can we do this without taking any damage? Probably not. Shoot, shoot your own friend. Do it, come on. Come on, you wouldn't. That's what I thought. Now where's your last friend? He's down there. Okay. Now I really don't want to risk hitting the boys. But I also don't want to... Okay, that was easy. Alright, so hello Simon and Waggus. Enjoy your new friend. I do not want to risk angering him. Alrighty, with that unpleasantness out of the way, it's time to crack on with today's episode. But first things first, it's important that we get some milk and get rid of this villager, pillager curse thingy. Because in today's episode, we are going to go over to the village farm. The village breeder and the iron farm and we are going to add a station there so as you'll remember from last episode we finished Casabrera central station here um, I've added a little thing over here for the, like a little extra tunnel exit for it to pop out of and I have actually managed to complete the railway all the way over to the village so we're gonna get in Hopefully it does not uh, go dark while we are riding this. Because I do not know how mob proof it is. But yeah, I'm just going to ride this all the way over to the village. And then we're going to build the next station. So yeah, just sit back and enjoy the train ride. Okay, it might get dark before we get there. That's right, there are plenty of beds there that we can snooze in once we get there. I just do not want to get blown up by a creeper or something while we're on the track here. That would be a real dampener on the mood. The lovely bit of scenery around. Very beautiful landscape. Yeah, we're almost there. I got some music going, so it might just quickly turn down. I'm guessing it's blocks. Yep. And here we go. Do the last tunnel here. And there's not exactly the cleanest way of having the rails down. But ideally it would just be a straight through. But we need powered rails, so that was my solution. Oh, nice try, creeper and skeleton. I am too fast. And just like that, we are at the end of the line. 
and ready to build the station. But first things first, I'm gonna have a little sleep. And then we're gonna seize the day once it's nice and light outside. Don't see any unfriendly creatures. Very good. Break this bad boy and pop down the chest of supplies. Cool. Alrighty, so what we're going to do is build a little platform here of wood because what I want to do is actually build like a central terminal kind of thing here. So we'll go go five deep so today's episode probably isn't going to be super long will just be a nice quick build here of the uh, of the station I just wanted to have something to put out for you guys because um, I probably won't have much of a chance to record um, over the weekend I'm actually going to uh, I will have a tournament my first ever on Sunday. So I've got to do all my usual houseworky stuff on Saturday. And then on Saturday night I have a friend's housewarming party, but just bought a house which very proud of them for doing in this economy. Can't imagine having enough money to buy a house. Can barely pay for rent. So good on them. But uh yeah, <clears throat> I just thought I'd film something tonight, something nice and quick, so that you have something to enjoy. Hopefully, enjoy. Okay, so that's pretty much the base down. Maybe I'll do one more. Why not? One more layer. And then we just gotta build the station. Cool. Alrighty, so I feel like if it comes down this way, just quickly pop that back. We need some more rails, torches. Very good. Okay, so if it comes this way, I feel like that's a good spot for it to kind of keep going to. And then we're gonna have one more rail here. It's going to be a bit, a little bit janky trying to get this to work, but we will make it happen. Sink down. Like that. Just so we have someone to put the redstone torch. There we go. Bada bing. Bada boom. I like to hide my redstone torches just so you can't really see what's going on. I mean everyone knows that they're there but it's just yeah looks a bit neater. Okay next we need I put that back we need a button we're gonna need some of this some stone fence stairs slabs probably half a stack of that why not bit of that bit of that okay that should do us Alrighty, um, I think if we do like a little tunnel entrance way thingy here, that look kind of good. Uh, we'll pop some stairs, little archway as it's coming into the station. Just like that. It's pulling in. Maybe we'll even do this kind of thing. And then once we're in, we just build a bit of this. Um, I guess I don't really want to make it too long, but uh, I guess I can make it a bit. Here, 
come down to like here maybe. That looks good. Mm -hmm. Cool. Alright. So um yeah, as I was saying, uh have a Warhammer tournament coming up this weekend, which is why I probably won't be able to film too much. Um if you guys are interested by the way in seeing any Warhammer content, I would be very open to doing either like some painting videos or something or um talking about once I start playing some more games, because this is my I like that it's my first ever tournament, so it'll be a bit new to me. But um if you guys are ever keen on seeing any like Warhammer content, just uh yeah, let me know in the comments because I would be more than happy to do some. Either like painting videos, battle reports or whatever. But uh if not, if you're happy to just stick with the games like Minecraft and Skyrim and Terraria eventually, that's cool too. Let me know what you think in the comments and we will see what happens. In the meantime, we'll just keep on trucking with this build. <clears throat> I was also thinking as well, maybe for 500 subs, I could do like a setup room tour kind of thing um, and then that way you'll be able to see all of my plastic shame both Warhammer and Lego because I got a lot of both okay so we have finished the general outline here of the station um, unfortunately what happened was I didn't like the uh, how this ended here. It kind of seemed off to me. I like having this kind of extra little bit here. So I had to extend this bridge. It used to be just one block either side of the stone here. But instead I've had to make it two on either side for symmetry and aesthetic purposes. So it's a little bit extra stuff to do, but that's okay. Because if it looks good, then it's worth it. So there you go. There is the updated bridge to the village farmer. We'll leave this as it is for now. Probably upgrade that at some point as well. But I think we'll also actually keep the trend of this going to here. There we go. And I've also kind of blocked in the rail over here for safety reasons because you know you can't have uh, pedestrians just walking willy-nilly onto the rails that would be very dangerous so now you can't to get into the station you have to come down the side here I'll probably fix it up at some point and make it a bit more looking proper like I have like a little bridge going over the tracks here like a railway crossing here maybe who knows but for now the way you get in is through the side here yum 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 do you drown I do where are you you bastard oh hello right there get back yeah. Nice. Okay. So yeah, like I said, that is the general shape done. Now, I think we're going to do like a little awning kind of thing here. No, not like that. Like that. Mm-hmm. Oops, that was the wrong thing. I wanted stairs up there. Like that. And then potentially we could even do... I don't know how I feel about those actually. Maybe we can do... Let's 
swap those around actually, now that I think about it. Do that there, and then we can do the stairs. Here. And he no, so close. So close again. There we go. And that's more like it. That's a nice little entryway. Okay. So we come in. It's a station. Uh, we'll probably have... Stone here, just because. But maybe not going that far out. This is all... As per usual on the Big Tasty Danish channel, we are just figuring out as we go along. There's no real plan here, we're just going with the flow. So maybe we'll go stone out of here. Quickly swim down and get all this wood floating around. Whee! Yum yum yum. Yoink, yoink, yoink. And quickly get back up. There we go. I'll probably have to do it one further back to here. So we'll go like that. There we go. And then we'll have fences going along here because, you know, no public access until the rails have docked. And then I'll have that here, have the button. Bang. Bang. I did this last time. do something like that. Sure. And then we can just have some torches along the walls here. So we can see where we're going. Lovely jubbly. One up there for good luck. And then I think that is the main interior done. We can maybe mess around with having like some benches here for like for sitting down waiting for the train. Potentially can add like a little ticket booth outside here. But for now I just want to get the, the station itself done. And the next part of that will be the roof. And some doors. Okay, so for the roof, I don't really know what I want to do. Um, I think maybe we can just do pretty stock standard. This is the train station. It doesn't have to look super duper fancy or anything. So I think if we just kind of do one set of stairs going all the way around which I will not have enough stairs for, but that's okay. We brought materials to build more. We can just kind of do this and then maybe we can do like a skylight or something because, you know, train stations sometimes have big old skylights. But we can see how we feel it's the beauty of this game. Everything is breakable, everything is replaceable. So, we can just go with how we're feeling at the time. Do some more stairs quickly. Lovely, that should be enough. Go up this really janky steps up here. Ba -ba -ba. Almost done. Like I said, not going to be a super long video today. Just going to get this station done. And then, happy days. 
we will have nice, easy, quick, relaxing transportation between our base and the village here, which is where we'll probably eventually at some point maybe start like a market stall. Or this could be like the travel hub for getting between here, for getting between the um, the stronghold and the end and stuff, because I know that that's over yonder some way. Um, so definitely want to have a railway going over there just to make life easier. But for now, I can happily just have a connection to here. Whoops, almost perfect. Lovely jubbly, and we're going to just pop some torches around here because I don't want any mobs to spawn up here. Not on my watch, thank you very much. Um, that'll probably do. So we'll quickly jump down. Whee! Shish. Clean up a little bit inside. And there we go. Just like that. Um, okay. It's going to make sure that it actually does reach where we need it to reach. So we here we come. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Very good. Zoom and doesn't quite make it. Well, shit. Um, I think we probably need to move this further down then. Um, probably need to put that one somewhere like here, just to really make sure that it reaches. Otherwise we are in trouble. So I'll quickly wipe that off. Get these bad boys back. Boom. 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 Should easily be okay now. One more little test run. Gonna be very scientific here on the Taste of Danish channel. So we're zooming along, coming in nice and slow, and then why does it keep slowing down so much here? Normally it makes it to the wall. Hmm. Very interesting. Maybe it'll work better coming from like fully full speed ahead. But for now, I'll keep testing that out try and figure out something to make that work. But for now, we'll quickly go and sleep before we christen the station, because this is actually also going to be dedicated to a subscriber. So, yeah. You know what I will actually do as well? We'll go... How many blocks is this? Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Okay, so we go like every three blocks. Like that. Just to make it look a little bit more interesting. We'll do something like that. Mm -hmm. Sure. There we go. That is, I think, for now, the final touch. Potentially make a glass dome roof here. But for now, I think, as is, looks pretty decent. And yeah, we will add the final touch, which is to christen it. Can we put it with sign on there? We can. We'll christen it ba, ba, ba. in honor of Deimos of the Wind. I know that's your full username. 
little bit wordy to put on the sign here. So we're going to call it Deimos, oops, Deimos Interchange. And there we go. Deimos of the Wind, I hereby build the station in your honor. Thank you for being a subscriber for the well, second longest on the channel. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoy the station. And yeah, that is pretty much it. Um, like I said, I'll have to do a bit more testing to figure out why it's not quite reaching all the way. But for now, I think I'm quite happy with how that station looks. So we're going to call it there for today. Uh, as always, I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, uh, leave a like. That really means a lot to me. Shows that you are enjoying the content that I'm making. Um, if you want to see more, subscribe if you haven't already. If you have, thank you. Tell your friends. Tell your enemies. Tell everyone about the channel here. And perhaps they too can have a building or a build dedicated to their honor in this world. But for now, thank you very much for watching as always, and I will see you guys in the next episode.